Hi guys, my name is Duncan, welcome to the channel. Just a quick video for all you Microsoft Flight Simulator players out there, specifically for anyone that doesn't know about the new custom made liveries that are now available for a few different aircraft. You see, there are a bunch of awesome people over at the Microsoft Flight Simulator forums that have banded together as a community to create some really awesome liveries to add an extra layer of realism and variety to the game. I've been having a look through some of these and I have to say I'm super impressed, especially because they look so good and, well, they're completely free. When the first videos appeared showing you how to do this, there was only a handful of skins for the A320 and the Boeing 747, but a few days later and there are already tons more. I mean, at the moment, we have a nice selection of liveries for the following aircraft. The A320, the 747, the Cessna 208B, the DA40, the Savage Cub, and my personal little dream machine, the Icon A5. Now, I'm going to take for granted that by the time anyone watches this video, there will probably be even more liveries available. So I'll leave a link to my Google Drive folder, which contains all the skins that I have to date. I will update this as frequently as I can, but I will also link to the main forum page link, which will be updated with some liveries much quicker. Which reminds me, the first step to installing these is to head to the forum and let these guys know how awesome they are for creating these for us. Then what you need to do is simply download the directory of liveries from the link provided and extract the files to your desktop or wherever you prefer. From there you just copy all the files and paste them into your community folder which is inside your Microsoft Flight Sim installation folder. For me this is my Steam Games folder but you might have chosen to install Microsoft Flight Sim elsewhere. And for the record if you're playing on Microsoft Game Pass I don't think that you can do this. I don't think that you can modify games when you're using Game Pass. I could be wrong, uh, if so, please let me know in the comments. Okay, so like I say, you just paste the livery packs that you downloaded into the community folder and that's it, it's done. It really is as simple as that, it's fantastic. Now when you log into Microsoft Flight Simulator, you're able to change aircraft liveries in the aircraft menu and as you can see, there is some really nice choices already with many more on the way. I will update the description of this video as I find any new links for new liveries and I will try my best to keep my Google Drive link updated with every skin that I can find whether it be from the Flight Simulator forum or any other sources that I can find. So be sure to come back and check often. So that's it for the video guys, hopefully this is helpful to some people out there. If it is, please let me know in the comments your favourite skin or any requests and I'll see what I can do to find it for you. To the guys that developed these skins, I want to give a personal thank you very much, <laughs> I really appreciate them. And to you guys, thank you very much for watching. Hope to see you again next time. Fly safe. Take care. Bye-bye.